And now at 5.30, Pittsburgh Steeler Ryan Shazier continues to recover from a frightening spinal injury six weeks ago. As CBS4 sports anchor Jim Barry found out, the South Florida native's biggest cheerleader is his dad, who has been a coach and spiritual mentor. I wear these every day, and I will, I will wear them until he, he jogs on that field again. The bracelets say Shaliv, and Vernon Shazier believes they capture the hope that his son will again play football. That notion is hard to imagine, considering what Ryan told his dad on the phone after being hurt in early December at Cincinnati. He said, um, Daddy, pray for me. I can't feel my legs. But the Lord shining the light on Praying is a way of life for Vernon Shazier, a minister who once served as a chaplain for the Dolphins. When his son suddenly faced the battle of his life, Shazier realized he must abide by his own sermons. I've been preaching and teaching faith for 22 years. That's what I've been feeding people. I say I'm just eating my own stew right now. The feeling returned in Ryan Chazier's legs. Now, the kid who cut his teeth on football fields in Broward County is grinding through a grueling rehab in Pittsburgh. The family won't get into specifics about his health, but the player who still remains connected to his Steeler Nation is apparently making strides. Every time he experience any type of improvement no matter how small it is we said that's another first down it's another first down the touchdown is coming that touchdown is when he's fully recovered and he's able to run again the vernon shays air shuttles back and forth from south florida to pittsburgh every week and every day he sends ryan uplifting text messages from the time he became a first round draft pick four years ago ryan chaser has dreamed of becoming a hall of famer despite his injury that dream still lives what if he can't play anymore, Vernon? If he can't play anymore, then God has a plan for him. You know, God has a plan. Well, Vernon Shazier is gratified by the support his son has received, and he is praising the Pittsburgh Steelers for keeping his son engaged with the team. He says that has given Ryan Shazier a huge emotional lift. You know, a lot of people here in South Florida, mm -hmm. especially his alma mater and plantation, That's rooting it. him on. No yeah. question about that. He's got a big following here, as does his dad. And uh, obviously you hear how... Uh, his faith is a big part of his life, and he has certainly given that to his family. I think that's really carrying them through this crisis right now. Faith, very important. Mm -hmm. We'll keep thinking Thanks, about Jim. them. Thanks very much, you got Jim. It.